sorry for the impromptu uh, live stream without any uh, real notification. Just had a few extra minutes, and instead of trying to make a ton of uh, videos on some of these uh, battleships, I figured, what the hell, we'll just uh, get a live stream in. Do some testing. I know some people are going to come on a little bit late since I just uh, really announced it. So, yeah, let's start playing. Start with California. Oh, goodness gracious, I am sore and stiff. nice uh greatest map for this but all players I like that oh hello mr. Alistair general Kenobi Where I had my chat box at. Hello, Mr. Hee Hee. Hope you're feeling better. So you're 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 a little sick today, huh? Ship. So slow, so simple. That could have been better. Look at this guy. One day, my friend, you will uh, you will stop doing that. You get to a point where you get too old and you can't do that anymore. Ah, I'm gonna keep shooting Bismarck. I like that shot better. Well, that was disappointing. Hey, I'm content to just farm damage off of Bismarck. I'm good with that. Nice shot. But yeah, I figured instead of doing a big video or a whole bunch of videos with all the Tier 7 battleships, I figure I'm going to play with them all today for a little bit. And make things a little easier on me. Show them off. Let's highlight them and watch me whiff every effing shot I take at these guys. We hit the enemy.
kind of want to push out there, but this whole side of our cap now is now undefended. So let's see what we can do. to a spot where I can lob the island here in a second. You might have led it too far, but hey. Ah, oh, that destroyer's going the other way. Alright, we got two minutes, though. I can still, uh... Still salvage this game. Everybody's playing so smart against me. I don't like this. seconds. This is horrifying. Nah, I should have taken a shot at uh, New Orleans. But I'm trying to, uh, I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm trying to get some damage here. This was a horrifying game for me. Horrifying. curious about is why is my all right why is my chat not popping up right Now I got it popped up where I can see it. All right. Oh, it's horrible, horrible, horrible. I don't want to put Dewey back on. You know what? Actually, I'm going to try. Halsey. I've tried Halsey on it before, but I'm going to throw Halsey on it and see what it looks like. Trying to play with Streamlabs while I'm doing this, though. I need to get a, uh, I need to get a little uh, session session in with Bob or Sly to figure everything out on this damn thing. Wow, we had a nice full game to this. Yeah, I said for everybody popping on them. 
Really just kind of wanted to, uh, wanted to kind of test out the Tier 7 battleships. But not have to do... Not have to do a massive amount of videos do on every one of them. So I figured I'd just start playing California for a little bit, and then we'll just start swapping battleships around and talking about them. This game's not going to be any fun, though. Too many bots. I've tested I tested Halsey on this. It's a it's he's fine on here. Our team captured the area. I still think I kind of like Dewey the best out of all of them on here. Hey, Marksman. I think I'm just going to keep going this way. But yeah, I don't know who all has picked up California yet. Like I said, I think it's a fantastic ship, but I also think... That if you have Florida or West Virginia, you can save your money and just play them because they're they're basically the same. A little bit different, but hey, what's going on, sir? over there because I'm not really worried about a bot destroyer. Although now that I said that he's gonna torp torp me. I'll switch over to Florida from here because that's at least a little bit of a different ship. One nice thing about this ship, and I really love it, that turret traverse is fantastic on this thing.
No, I just started uh, Marchman. I can go there next. I just pulled out California to... Uh, I didn't announce this at all until like the last second when I realized I could do it. go top I don't know my, my top battleships at tier 7 Rodney's definitely probably number one I don't know about the where, where I uh, where I put California at Toss Rodney out there. Oh, Rodney's fantastic. It's a great ship. Decent amount of people on right now. Not too excited about the, uh... <laughs> What's up, arsonist? Mr. Snoot. Battle starts. Uh, not too fond of the aircraft carrier in here, but... Capture area C. Teleport in Webrick Moss. Dachi is a cruiser problem. All right, Wichita, what are you up to? Precise aim activated. Really expecting to nuke him there. We got I got Toby on this thing. I can't complain about full pens, but for the low, you know, I figured we'd get a citadel there. Good job. And there.
sneak around the island so we can do this California. Somewhat disappointing. Maybe I'm aiming a little too high on this guy. Nope. want to take shots at that damn indomitable fun police Laughing downstairs, my wife is holding a cooking class for her co-workers. Only thing that sucks about it is I have to smell her. She's got stew and fresh bread going. Survive long enough to get a heal off and get a couple more shots in on somebody. Yeah, take him out for me. Oh, I took out a uh, mutton roast out of the freezer. We're chopping that up for uh, stew tonight because that makes the best. Some of the best stew I've ever had. I had. I make the other night. Delmonico's. We went down to uh, your neck of the woods, Mr. Arsonist. There on the other side of uh, D.C., going down towards. Uh, oh, if you get off at Andrews Air Force Base and start heading like southeast, we got a guy down there that raises cows that we buy a cow off of every uh, every year. We had some like nice inch thick Delmonico's that we uh, we grilled out. It was a couple days ago. Oh, so nice. But no, on the stew front. Butchered a. I don't remember what I butchered that sheep. I think it was in uh, over the fall I butchered that sheep. And uh, mutton's got a nice flavor to it to make a uh, really flavorful stew. The only thing that could make it better would be if I had more bear meat left. So that was Rodney. Let's put Ford out. Let's test him. Let's test him with the Holden door first. Where do they hide him? I haven't had goat yet. Goat I haven't done yet, but uh, I still have two more sheep that I'm getting ready to uh, phase out of existence here uh, next month. And go strictly to my rabbits and my birds, because I'm too old to be shearing sheep. I 
that's the one thing I can't I can't get. I should have picked some up when I was down there, but I, I didn't have enough cooler space. I should have picked up some crab when I was down there. I'm crashing into this guy. I haven't played Florida in forever. Wow. Oh, uh, Arsenal, she should ask Alistair about, uh, he, uh, I gave him some duck breasts, and he seared them and, and kind of cooked them up like steaks. She'd ask him how they turned out. At this point, arsonist, I'm kind of not picky where they come from. I think they just have some crab meat. But no, yeah, I, 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 I'm going to try, cross my fingers and try, hopefully my friend, uh, hope I can get down there to Maryland and uh, hope I can get my friend to bring up some crab meat for me. Ducks like a, um, I mean, it looks like it, it kind of looks like a chicken breast and a, a, a skinny chicken breast, but it's more of a red meat than a, uh, than an actual, um, yeah, you can't call it like white meat. It's more like a, uh, it's actually like a, a red meat. It's, it's so rich in iron. Now I've had wild duck. And it was just, to me, it was really good. And, and obviously, I've got domestic ducks, so there's no, uh, I don't notice any gaminess to it. You know, duck, goose, turkey. Turkey season starts up next week. I can't wait for that. Because the, the, uh, my domestic birds, they're more in line with what a uh, with what a wild turkey looks like, being that they're kind of small, versus the uh, ones you actually buy in the store for Thanksgiving. But that meat's got a nice texture to it, and it's just, I don't know, it's just a lot more flavorful, I think, in my opinion, anyways. Target 
No, nah, I was laughing watching Bob or listening to Bob stream the other day. And everybody's talking about grocery stores and meat at grocery stores, and I'm out there butchering rabbits uh, to, to, put, to put in the freezer. I was going to say, for some of you who don't know that might be viewing this, I, I have a small farm that I, uh, I raise my own meat on. I don't go to the grocery store for that stuff anymore. Pretty good. That, that's a hell of a nice hit on a uh, Arizona. Arizona's tanky as hell. Turret traverse on this always piss me off. I'll steal that. Yeah, Florida's still still good. I said it's been a while since I played it, but no, it's it's still still a great ship. And that was with Oldendorf on there. What about Mr. Dewey? Yeah, I'll come back to that one. I was going to say, here's one of my other favorite ones for, uh, I'll try Tovey on it. I like Hood. I don't know if anybody has it or not. Or if they dislike it or what, but I, I do like Hood. Hood is a fun ship. Nothing like getting a uh, nuisance call about taxes I don't know on. Battle start. Oh, you'd like this one, an, an arsonist. that 31 knot battleship it's fantastic get yourself into trouble with the damn thing though now I go to a sign up California all right three destroyers oh iOS crash number one Let's see what happens since I left. 
Now, the thing with low tier battleships, if you are trying to learn how to play battleships better, this is this is the spot to do it, I think. Like, tier 7 is a great tier for it because not all the battleships are super slow. You got a little bit, of, little bit of variety, and they're great captain trainers for people. Get a Strasburg. I'll pull Strasburg out. I like Strasburg, but be you know, let's be honest, it's not the greatest ship in the world. That's the other nice thing about Hood. The guns on this thing are no joke. I'm just gonna keep backing up. I'm, I'm not in a good spot here. All right, guys. I crippled Naga, thank you. I was gonna say, I crippled Naga, so can we take it out? TVs are back there. Oh God, this is absolutely torture. Smelling that stew starting to cook up downstairs. Oh. Put myself in a bad spot. Let's find out. Enemy torpedo spotted. The situation is under control. Oh, yes, I did.
And now we just run. Run for our life. It wasn't a great game, but it's not bad. It's not a bad ship, though. All right, we'll, let's pull out the dumb ship. I'm going to talk about stupid ships. Let's pull out the dumbest of them all at Tier 7. Yeah, it wasn't bad. I don't know what to do is I don't know what to do with this one I don't know what to do with the first slot there's nothing great there it's like 11 kilometers you know we're gonna try something different It's not bad. I should buy the historical camel for it, but I'm too lazy. What's up with the matchmaking? I spend, I guess, I spend a little just too much time out outside of uh, a match, and I, I miss my uh, all the players. camo Well, figured we figured out Hood's a faster ship, but this thing's got the engine accelerator. Play a sign off. Engine boost activated. No, 
gonna swing back around and hit their base. I appreciate that, man. Do appreciate that. I mean, there's not... Let's be honest. There's not a lot to California. Since it's so slow, you just gotta be so so cautious about where you put yourself and you're, and you're golden in that ship. to do it, but I'm sick and tired of getting lit on fire by you. Most worthless ship in Blitz right here. It's stupid. It's fun, but it's boy, it is a dumb ship. Who's got this ship? Who survived the, uh, who's been around long enough when they were giving these things away for free for coming back into the game, but West Virginia's always been a good ship. Ship Smasher. I haven't seen I don't see many of those out there. Yeah, West Virginia is like it's it's a it's a great ship still. Like I said, with California coming out, and you know, like I said, I really like California, uh, but I, I started playing around with some of the other ships, trying to get some videos on them, and figured this is just easier to do it. Just just start dumping them out on uh, on a live stream. But yeah, West Virginia is great. Wish it had a little more range to it. You know, since 
they introduce California, and you know, California's got ridiculous range at you know, 15 and a half. All right, Wichita's out there. Capture the target area. There's gonna be a lot of torpedoes coming through there. Why did I zero pin the Vanguard? Alright. Got the cast. I don't have to go running in there. Oh no, trust me, I, I get it that, that that's a long range for but still. I think if you if, if your top speed's under twenty one knots, that should give you an automatic range boost. Since we're talking about country home there, I dare you guys, anybody, to call the West Virginia Department of Motor Vehicles and sit on hold for about an hour waiting to talk to somebody. And that's their, that's their on hold music. That song, over and over and over again. It's enough to test any man's sanity. And use Vladdy as a torpedo shield. Sorry, Vladdy. Hey, at least he's in the cap with me. Ship smasher. Nice tanky ship unless you're getting hit by West Virginia guns at point blank range. I can actually get, do get some work here. I, I've got a halfway decent game going. Target hit. We're hit. Precise aim activated. To 
All right, Vanguard, dodge those torpedoes. I believe in you, Vanguard. You can do it. Stop shooting him. It's my damage. Target locked. Precise aim activated. I shouldn't bitch about 110k in a tier 7, but I think I had a shot at bigger damage there. So what, uh, so I gotta ask everybody's watching, like, who's your favorite commanders on some of these ships? out in a while either. Like, I don't know who works the best. If it's Dewey, if it's uh, Oldendorf. I know people like Halsey on some of them. And there's the one problem. I said, I guess the tier seven is a great place to learn how to play battleship. The only problem is you get the tier eights every now and then. Spot some stuff here. Huh. I wonder what's there. Good job. Enemy torpedo spotted. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I, that's, that's that's like my go-to with precise aim for the most part. Is Dewey. Oh, I pulled Oldendorf out on like uh, on a couple of them, and he works great too. But I really like having the um, I really like having that precise aim skill that Dewey's got. that dispersion Oof. or me see if I can redeem my 
myself here. All right, lightning's over there. Target hit. Yay, we can push. Enemy torpedo spotted. Enemy aircraft incoming. Oh, this ship is so... It, it, this ship's so much fun. I pulled out Gneisenau now for... Uh, to start working on testing on that, and I forgot how much fun Gneisenau now is. Not looking forward to uh, working on Bismarck and... Friedrich de Gros, because, oh, those were painful back in the day. Situation is under control. Enemy aircraft incoming. We're hit. Enemy aircraft incoming. We're hit. nowhere so might as well just have fun right bonsai all right let me run down real quick grab a thing of water be right back Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. Oh, 
All right. Yeah, Les, that's the problem I have with Bismarck now. I don't know how, I don't know how good Bismarck is nowadays. It used to be such a great ship. You know what? Let's. We putts around enough at tier seven. Let's uh, let's take Bismarck out. See what I can do with it. Now I'm not. Yeah, all right, have fun at work. But yeah, I'm not going to go nuts and, and play around with the commander on this, so we'll give it a go. I don't get stupid. I might actually have a decent game here. See what happens. So is everybody's pushing off to the other side there. Turpits. I say I might have a good game. The CV says, uh, nay, nay. Should be smart. I should put Shear on here so I can level him up at least. We hit the enemy. This is on fire. We're under attack. Good job. Let's see if I can get on the other side of the map now. Capture area B. Like I said, Bismarck, is just, I don't know. It's just so, t it's, it's just so power crept. That's the word I'm looking for.
you know, with everything that came into the game. I'm oh, sorry about this, Nebraska. I'll steal that kill. Thank you. shot in hell of hitting this guy, but what the hell. Two minutes left. I should go swing down here, maybe get shots on Vanguard, and then swing back up there and get get some shots out on the uh, Dejan. That wasn't too bad. All right, help this Nebraska out, poor guy. No, it's not the worst game I've had with Bismarck in a while. Enemy team captured the area. Maybe Dispersion will help me out with that one. Nope, never mind, he's gone. I think someone's out of planes. What do you guys think? Yep, over his head. Oh, that was worth a shot. around down here at the lower tier is too long. What do we have? Uh, let's go jump up and play. I haven't played this one in a while. few more games in before dinner time probably have enough time for like I don't know four or five games maybe maybe I'll just torture myself bounce down to tier 9 after this one and torture myself with some of the ships down there from Georgia. Alright, we've got a game here. Nice. Or, my game could crash. 
I always crash too. That's all right, I didn't want to run into the cap anyway, so, uh, jump in on a little delay. In. Throws your car first. Let's see, since it looks like Grocer's getting a little uh, aggressive here, let's uh, switch to him. I was hoping they'd run out. Grocer should be out. Sleeping. I don't know if I want to switch the sap yet. I don't know where these destroyers are, so we're going to switch over. Leafing should be out. What is going on with these people? I'm not arguing, but geez. Enemy ship Why are we all over the place? Worcester's going to take itself out of the game. We're hit. We're hit. Enemy torpedo spotted. We hit the enemy. Torpedo. Is under control. All right. Let's hope we're not to take any of those. Torpedoes everywhere. Yeah, at least I can't complain about the fact that uh, there's too many destroyers in this match. 
Normally I hop on tier 10 and I get five, six. You know, it'd be like five destroyers, an aircraft carrier, and like a cruiser. That's my normal tier 10 matchmaking. Ponto should be fine. Yep. Let's see if I overshot the Shimikaze. I ought to slap him, though. Think someone's running a legendary mod, huh? Hey, I have no shame, Alistair. I'm more, I'm more than willing to throw another battleship in my way to avoid torpedo hits. shame in using another ship as my torpedo sponge. Not too bad. Why am I getting all these spam calls all of a sudden? Time to change the settings on my phone back to, uh, torture myself let's torture myself here well maybe not torture this guy I don't know if you get anybody's pick this ship up but this is a pretty good ship That's got to, well, I mean, that's like get down Mr. President moment there, Alistair. I wasn't sold on, on, on uh, Baji, but uh, I was playing against, when we were practicing for Rules of the Waves, I was practicing with Golden, and uh, boy, he really showed me this ship's actually really good. So I had to pick it up from there. Like anything with a scout plane and a rapid reload, I, I should have loved it because of uh, I like Black Kansas and that's what it has. The only downside is the one secondary. It's got some auto secondaries, but one secondary gun? Are you kidding me, guys? Kremlin was up and running. I'd really like to have a Kremlin to uh, hide behind. Enemy team captured the area. Target spotted. Yeah, I wasn't sure though if I if I would actually like this ship or not. I, that's why I was holding off. I wouldn't get it for the longest time, and uh, you know, because it's an Ismo clone, and I'm. Uh, 
Not exactly fond of Ismo. Like I said, I was one, doing 1v1s against Gold, and he fought it out, and we were talking about the ship afterwards, and I was like, damn, it's actually pretty good. And then it's nice, because you get the, uh, you don't have to buy a historical camo for it, since it's not the prettiest camo in the world, but it's there, it's free, can't go wrong there. And then the other thing is now I've got a... an extra ship when we do when they personal challenges come back out you know there's an extra ship to play with go you dirty bot Yes, watch the power of this one secondary. I was, I ain't gonna lie, I was a little optimistic when uh, the new update came out and the bots seemed like they were behaving somewhat normal. I see that the uh, that that was just uh, wishful thinking on my part. You can catch on fire and die. Don't want to waste my main gun salvo on you. I appreciate you not shooting turps at me, Gary. off my Kremlin. Here making the uh, getting the bread, showing the guys how to make bread down there. Kidding me. Enemy team is about to win. Our team. <laughs> Would 
did you die? Oh my god, that was horrible. God, those shots in the Vermont. Oh, God bless. That was... That was horrible. Yeah, Baji, though. Baji's pretty good. torture ourselves correctly here. Let's pull the Jean Bard out for a game. Fifteen people a tier eight. Give me a tier eight match. Cross my fingers. Hope for the best. Nope, not gonna happen. Or Minnesota, Minnesota, Worcester, Seattle. Eh. Interesting. Well, let's see what uh, what trouble I can get myself into with this thing. Action station. I wonder if I can actually like you know have a good game and show you guys that this ship actually can be played. It isn't that bad. Roger that. Roger that. I'm just gonna push the cap and see if I can uh, stay away from my island, Des Moines. Granted, she got no fire and flooding defense. Target hit. But if we don't get burned down by Worcester, that'd be embarrassing. This could be an embarrassing one. Maybe I shouldn't have done this one. Maybe nothing else can shoot at me. This is going to piss me off.
Oh, I love the Seattle's name. That's great. Thank you, Holland. I appreciate that. I am not having any luck last hitting anything today. up in 20 seconds undetected over here that's very no, no, spoke too soon trigger this rapid reload here and see what we can do Fast reload activated. don't look at me Minnesota I'm not here I'm invisible Please don't shoot me. Engine boost activated. Right, let's see if I can sneak up to the next island. What a charred paint job on that guy. This is gonna hurt. Alright, what are you doing? Is the still alive? Where is that guy? I'll be with you in a second, Worcester. Calm down over there. Alright, everybody, raise your hands if you thought I was going to survive that match. I sure as hell didn't. And I MVP'd it. Holy crap. I can't believe that. Alright, since we're taking trash ships out... Since we're taking trash ships out, let's do a couple more trash ships before I call it a day. So, got the black Ismo here. 
Throw some other trash battleships out there, and I'll see if I got them, and I'll play them. Montana, Montana. I like the map for this one anyways. Battle start. Like the map, no aircraft carrier, that's nice. Is he going to stay detected for him? No, he's not. Enemy team captured the area. That one's... Worcester, I guess. No, Mino's coming back in. God bless him. Look at him go! Where is their other Montana? That's the question. Nice shot. Gdansk and Ragnar. Slow down. Select the AP here or a HE here in a second. Because Black Repub should be able to take that Montana out now. Same activated. Target hit. Now let's see if I can MVP this match with this pile of junk. Fast reload activated. There's a 
big caliber, nice. Don't think we're breaking a hundred K though. Our team is about to win. And we beat it though, Black Ismo, guys. I don't know what other pile of junk I can pull out though. Well, I think this is the. Got this one. I can pull out this pile of junk. <laughs> Wish me luck. forever and it looks like we're gonna be guaranteed for a tier 10 match so very nice double sleep and Janan Minotaur Holland Shima and Shima all right this ought to be interesting Almost tempted to switch to HE right off the bat just to uh, see if I can spot a Shimakaze. That's alright, I just want to see what the hell is out there. There's a Shema. Not too far behind, but that's alright. Minotaurs over there. Holland will take bullpens. Don't know where the other Shema went, but that's all right. Hopefully, Gdansk will find them for me. Oh my god, I am just horrible. <laughs> this is horrible. I was dropping dimes of the uh, Black Ismo on this thing, on this, uh, on this uh, Minotaur, and I can't hit the broad side of him now. What did I do?
did more damage with secondaries than I've done with my main guns all game. That's just pathetic. Horrifying, but could have been worse. Yeah, we ate some full pens. Nice. Enemy torpedo spotted. Torpedo. Hmm. I can know where he is. I just don't want to quite waste a shot on him yet. that Enemy torpedo spotted Attack target Nice shot Let's see if I can actually I get to 40,000 without dying here Turn it into torpedoes. This is horrible. Yes, high level gameplay here, boys and girls. We hit the enemy. We're under attack. Good job. Die, Papa Squadron. Oh, before I die, we'll just launch him off. Wow. Sorry, guys. That was just dreadful. I'm not even going to bother dodging those. Apparently, I mentally challenged myself too much playing those other other ships. All right, I think one more game, and then I'm gonna call it. Silver boosters on and give it a go. So last game incomparable. What's the worst could happen? Come 
ask for a Hindenburg. Exactly liking how this how this spawn worked out here. Capture area C. Roger that. Okay, we're gonna go wide. We're gonna flank out a little bit here. Undetected. Is Hindenburg going to eat some torpedoes for me? Can't eat a couple, and then let's see what happens here. Second Iowa. Alright, what's the what are the chances Hindenburg burns out? Now I'm gonna swing myself around the island eventually. Get stuck in the island. Look at me, I'm a bot. Ooh, am I gonna hit those torps too? Good job. Let's see, turned out. Good job. Good job, my friend. I'm gonna go get a shot at that aircraft carrier. Out. 
Lisa Bald. That's a great name. That's a great bot name. Oops. The situation is under control. Alright, well, that's a good good way to end the uh, afternoon. Thanks, everybody who showed up and watched my little very impromptu stream. Hopefully, I can start actually scheduling these out. I don't know yet, though. Time's a little... Uh, the next couple weeks or next month's going to be a little funny for me with uh, my schedule. So... Ah, perfect timing. Perfect timing since we just crashed. So, that's a sign from God right there. Y'all have a good one. And, uh, yeah, I'll get a video out tomorrow. Um, probably uh, Bayarn. Work on the German uh, battleship line since I got to putz around with the uh, tier 7 premiums today.